there's someone here. That voice! Annis! This is my special place. You can't just come barging in. You're not welcome here, Annis. Ferris is your special place? What do you mean? This... this is where I was born. My family all died in the flood. Mommy Liger saved me. I was so lonely, but Van came one day and invited me to join him. He stopped Ferris from sinking and made it into my own private ship. Van and the others have visited several times. They said they'd make this our base. So this was my brother's headquarters. And most likely a facility for pharmacy. If you're talking about a replica machine, then yes, we have one. We need it. After all, Van promised he would recreate my whole city. That's nothing but an illusion. Replicas aren't your family or even a replacement. No, you're wrong. Look at Luke. He's a replacement for Ash. Ion understood me. He even helped Van. The only reason Ion changed was because Annis took over as phone master guardian. You're wrong. Master Van has tricked you. Luke, be quiet. But you betrayed him, Annis. What, are you saying you want that duel here and now? My mediator Largo will decide the place. You can wait to hear from him. I fought for Ion and for Van, but now Ion is gone. I'm going to get revenge. I won't lose. What a fool. She doesn't even realize she's being used. If what Arietta said is true, then we can assume that this is one of Van's facilities. Yes. Let's keep looking. Is that all right, Annis? Yeah. This is Pharmacry? Impressive. Such a large-scale endeavor operating even now. So, this is where they're making the replicas. Eamon and the others may have been made here, too. Let's shut it down. Perhaps that will help ease the expenditure of Seventh Phonons. Right. I don't think this world needs any more replicas. Even with just me, it's already one too many. Luke. Stop. Why are you doing this? Why do you oppose the birth of our brethren? We will all be given a new place to live upon the heavenly plane. Do not interfere. Are all of you okay with that? It's not like you were born because you were wanted. You're wrong. We were all born because Moe's wanted us. If you say so, Mary. But once your heavenly plane is completed, your originals will all be killed. Why should we care if those who don't accept us are killed? That's barbaric! Without those originals, we... No replicas could be born! So? Now that we have been born, why should we stay beholden to the originals? Luke, you could learn a thing or two from them. What? Confidence. That's why Ash gets mad at you. That's why you have trouble with Emperor Peony. You lack confidence. Call it a will to live that borders on arrogance. You had it once. You would call us arrogant? Yes, I would. And someday your own words may be turned right back at you. I wonder if you'll be able to say the same thing then.
No. Moses moved ahead with his plan without us. You promised us a place on the new Hod. The new Hod? So that's Hod? What are we to do? We go to the site of our covenant, the Tower of Rem. Surely Moe's will come for us. But the navigational equipment was destroyed with the Famacry facility. We'll eventually drift ashore if we follow this current. We'll walk from there. Agreed. Spread the word. They're gone. What should we do? Do we just let them go? I can't imagine Moe's taking them in. Well, if it were me, I would certainly cut them off. As long as he has the data, he can make as many replicas as he pleases. So they're simply to be abandoned? In all likelihood. Though I doubt they'll realize that for a while. They still believe in Moe's. So is that island in the sky really hot? If so, then that would make it the replica land that Van envisioned. I guess we'll find out when we get there. It seems risky. But you're right. Okay, let's ask Noel to take us up to that floating island. 